What's up guys, this is Sean Heather and in this video we are going to do a benchmarking test comparison between Realme 7 5G, Realme 7 Pro, Realme 6 Pro and Realme 6 smartphones. All of them got 8GB RAM, 128GB storage and Android 10 as OS. Realme 7 5G got MediaTek Dimensity 800U processor, Realme 7 Pro and Realme 6 Pro got Qualcomm Snapdragon 720G processor and Realme 6 got Helio G90T processor. And in this video we are going to see that how much difference we are going to get in terms of performance and benchmarking score depending on their hardware specs. So these are the benchmarking applications we got today on all of these devices we have already performed all of this test and we're just going to have a quick look on the test score results so first of all let's start with the end to the benchmarking so realme 7 5g scored 345,231 realme 7 pro scored 288,886 realme 6 pro scored 287,667 and Realme 6 scored 290,201. So Realme 7 5G is the winner here. After that it is Realme 6 then Realme 7 Pro and then at the last spot it's Realme 6 Pro. If we go to the individual test score result here you can compare the performance of CPU, GPU, memory and UX for all of these devices so once again realme 7 5g is the winner in all of these four tests after that in cpu the winner is realme 6 pro in gpu the winner is realme 6 in memory the performance of once again realme 6 is better and when it comes to user interface performance of realme 7 pro is better but as you can see that the difference is not too much when it comes to memory and user experience between realme 7 pro 6 pro and realme 6 so let's go back from here and let's have a look on the next test and that's 3d mark it's a gaming benchmarking test so it gives the idea about the gaming capability and also the gpu capability of the device so this test is divided in two parts slingshot and slingshot extreme and once again slingshot extreme is divided in opengl and vulcan but as you can see that for Realme 7 5G and 7 Pro, we do not have the Vulkan information because for some reason the test result is not showing the Vulkan part. So we will just talk about the Slingshot and Slingshot Extreme OpenGL. So first of all, let's talk about the Slingshot. So here you can see that Realme 7 5G scored 4405, Realme 7 Pro scored 3573, Realme 6 Pro scored 3486 and Realme 6 scored 3149 so it is in the sequence now first position second position third position and the fourth position now talking about the slingshot extreme open gl realme 7 5g scored 3229 realme 7 scored 2536 realme 6 pro scored 2500 and realme 6 scored 2540 so this time first position second position third position and fourth position but once again as you can see that the difference is not too much between these three devices and the winner is realme 7 5g and now it's time for the last test and that's going to be the geekbench 5. so this test is divided in two parts single core and multi-core and once again Realme 7 5G is the winner in both single core and multi core. After that, it's Realme 7 Pro at the second spot in both single core and the multi core. Then at the third spot, it's Realme 6 Pro, and after that, it's Realme 6 once again in the same sequence 1, 2, 3, 4. And talking about the Geekbench 5 compute test, Realme 7 5G is at the first spot. After that, it's Realme 6, then Realme 7 Pro, and then Realme 6 Pro. So as we can see that in all of these three tests, and to the Geekbench 5 and 3D Mark performance of Realme 7 5G is the best. And after that, it's shifting between the Realme 7 Pro, Realme 6 Pro, and Realme 6. Most of the time the score is pretty much same and the difference is very minute, especially between 
Realme 7 Pro and Realme 6 Pro because both of these devices they are pretty much same in terms of hardware specs as they both got same CPU, GPU, RAM, storage, Android version as well. So that's all for now friends. Thanks for watching this video. If you found it useful, then give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends, subscribe the channel and do not forget to press the bell icon to get the notification for future uploads and I will see you guys next time in another video. Have a nice day.